Let me read for you out of James chapter 3, beginning with verse 13. Who among you is wise and understanding? Let him show by his good behavior his deeds and the gentleness of wisdom. But if you have bitter jealousy and selfish ambition in your heart, do not be so arrogant as to lie against the truth. This wisdom is not which comes down from above, but is earthly, natural, and demonic. For where jealousy and selfish ambition exist, there is disorder in every evil thing. It sounds like Ferguson doesn't. Yes, it does. Verse 17. But the wisdom from above is first pure, then peaceable, gentle, reasonable, full of mercy, good fruits, unwavering, without hypocrisy. And the seed whose fruit is righteousness is sown in peace by those who make peace. Now, the part of that passage of scripture, it's very clear that the good seed is peaceable. It's reasonable. The bad seed is unreasonable and rebellious. And it says there that talking about the unreasonable and rebellious, the bad seed, a warning to anybody, you know, if you want to know which way to go, if you have bitter jealousy, jealous for whatever reason, color of somebody's skin, the money guy they got, the education, the wife, the house, whatever, Or selfish ambition. I want, I want, I want, I want to get, I want to get. If you have bitter jealousy and selfish ambition, don't be so arrogant. Don't be stupid now and lie against the truth because of those things. We're all attacked with jealousy and ambition. But don't cross the line and be so arrogant as to think you can lie against the truth. And say, you know, make a lie, build a society, uh, build a case, prop up something false behind your bitter jealousy and selfish ambition. Because Romans chapter 1 verse 18 tells us that the wrath of God is revealed from heaven against all ungodliness and unrighteousness of men who suppress the truth, push it down in unrighteousness. So the truth in the matter of Ferguson is the looters, the hellraisers, the Jacksons, the Sharpstons, the Stephanopoluses, the whites, the blacks who are fight, fight, kill, rape, murder, burn. They're the bad seed. There's something they want to do that. Everybody's making a choice in life. To do what's right or wrong. And God's put it in the hearts of all men to know this. That's in the same chapter in Romans. Because so therefore they're without excuse. Everybody everywhere. God's put it in their heart to know right and wrong. Making a choice. Because of what you want. To, lie, to make a lie. To make what you want look right. When it's really wrong. The word says. Do not be that arrogant. Hold your horses. Because God will do something bad to you. Let alone send you to hell. People don't like to be lied to and lied on. Don't lie on God. Don't lie against the truth. Michael Brown asked to get himself blown away according to the written word of God. White people didn't write the Bible. Black people didn't write the Bible. The Holy Ghost, the Holy Spirit wrote the Bible. So, if you've got selfish ambition and bitter jealousy, don't be so arrogant as to think before you lose your soul. We all battle those things. That you're going to change the truth of God's word and call it a lie 
and say this evil these people are doing that God says don't do is right. There's no place to hide. Judgment day is coming. And you're going to bring evil upon yourself. Don't play with the written word of God. Jesus is Lord. 